The warm, late afternoon sun blanketed Raven Spears in a comforting embrace as he stepped out into the front yard of his cabin. He breathed in the scent of sun-baked ponderosa pines and crisp mountain air. The fragrant aromas were joined by the gaminess of soil from a fresh rain and the smoky hint of a nearby campfire. A nearby stream burbled with the whisper of wind through leaves in a quiet natural symphony. His bare feet crushed the gentle leaves of grass poking up from the twigs and pebbles. Today was the epitome of peaceful. He felt relaxed, but there was always the lingering horror of the past two years in the back of his mind. The death and losses had piled up. For that reason, he was glad he wasn't alone. His sister, Sandra, was with him, staring at a small fire burning next to the sweat lodge adjacent to his cabin. Her dark hair was swept back in a ponytail, and she wore a mask of concentration as if deep in thought. Skinny eight-year-old Allie bent down next to the orange flames, stoking a burning log heating a hanging pot. She was a miniature, spitting image of her mother. Raven's one-eyed Akita, Creek, wagged his tail, tongue hanging out. He looked happily back and forth between his human family members. Careful, Sandra chided Allie as Raven approached. Don't burn yourself. I'm fine, Mom, Allie said. Jeez. Sandra looked to Raven. You know she's stubborn as a wild horse. I blame you for that. Raven held up his hands in a mock defensive gesture. She's your daughter, sis. Yeah, but I think she spent too much time with you. Yup, Allie said with a chuckle. I'm stubborn like Raven. Raven gave Allie a mischievous grin as he knelt next to her. I'm really stubborn? <laughs>